He gave many convincing evidences that he was alive. I had people trying to influence me to do weed, mm. um, you know, drugs, drinking, I mean, stuff like that. So the stress that you go through, found out I was deploying to Afghanistan. On returning from Afghanistan, I had a lot of questions that came up. What's the point of life, you know? Like, are we born just to die? Like, why do bad things happen? You've got why? these massive dreams of getting back and just having the sickest holiday vid all of your friends have seen. Like, we want to go to church and keep all the laws and we want to be in the world and be admired by all. Friendship is what really gets you through like the, the really tough times because things aren't always like perfect. And Brad prays for people. This seems to give him power. When I was a teenager, I put all of my self-worth in my achievements. People have a capacity to be truly horrible you see people being rough. Overcooked vegetables pretty much are saying it's only half as good as it could be. In so the early days of our church, young people had been at the very forefront of the world. Hi, and welcome to The Perspective, a place where we discuss faith, culture, and yes, life. Too. The fact that young people are leaving the church is often after someone's baptized, we don't disciple them. Your entire life consists of weighing up choices. Whether it's the career you pursue, where you choose to live, or the friendships you make. Before you start writing, you need a plan. I recently travelled through Jordan and Israel with a group of Aussies following in the footsteps of Jesus. Jesus.